It's John Siskovich and my curious sheep are nibbling on the tripod and I give them hay even when they're out on pasture. Let me explain. So I tried to shoot this video inside with them inside the fence but they were chewing on the tripod and it was getting really shaky. But you can kind of see hanging in the middle of their shelter there is a bag and every day we put a little bit of hay in it. Uh, and that does a couple things for us. If there's a lot of water on the grass and the sheep are eating fresh grass, they might get a little bit of bloat so they can eat the hay to kind of balance how much water they've had. Um, if they don't want it, they just leave it there. Uh, and sometimes we'll just have to take it out. But the hay that we're giving them doesn't cost much money, uh, so it's not a big problem. <clears throat> the other reason why we put hay in is to start to judge our pasture rotations. So we have the hay hanging uh, safe and dry in their sheep shelter. And if they've eaten everything that they want and even beyond everything what they want, you know, if they've gone through all the ice cream out on pasture, then they'll start to eat the hay. And if we put new hay in and we see that they've eaten that down, it's time to give them a new fence. Uh, it's not a perfect science, but it's one of the ways we tell that it's really time to rotate them. You also look at the ground and see, you know, manure and uh, what the condition of the grass is like, how far they've eaten it down. You don't want to eat it, you know, too far, but you want to put the, the right amount of pressure on it. Uh, so that's why we feed hay out on pasture. I can see that these guys have moved in here recently, but I put some fresh hay out this morning. They've eaten down from what, from what I put out this morning, so I'm going to give them a second fence right now and open up some new area for them. But that's why we feed hay out in pasture. Uh, I don't know if everybody does this. Uh, I would love to hear... You know, if anybody's got some feedback, leave it in the comments below uh, and keep the conversation going. So until next time, uh, thanks for stopping in and I will see you out in the fields.